Thank you very much, Ted. Well, Doc, you know, you've got an awful lot of experience here in that fabricating, working with these mowers. Tell me about this business that you got uh, going on here. Well, basically what we got into was uh, a form of racing that a lot of guys were doing this out of the backyards, building some pretty good equipment. We came from the pro world of drag racing. We've seen some, some problems with, the, with what they were building. So we tried to get some better quality equipment, make it safer for the guys out there. One of the things we're doing, this built-in spindle assembly. Most of the guys will butt weld this assembly, and you're worried about a butt weld. We actually mill it, set it in, and now you've got a shear weld. So it's three times stronger than they're doing at the same price. You know, you bring your, your entire fabrication knowledge here. And how much crossover between drag racing and, and mowing is there? Well, there's a little bit. It's all about performance parts. It's all about going fast. But you know what? We're having a great time and great people to deal with. This is Ed's boat. It costs big bucks. <laughs> yeah. This is Staybill fuel stabilizer. It costs a couple of bucks. When Ed stored his boat, he didn't add Staybill. Yeah. Too bad. Because the fuel inside broke down and gummed up his engine. Now it won't start. And Ed is looking at some big bucks for repairs. Poor Ed. At least he added Stay Bill when he stored his collector car and his motorhome. Right, Ed? Remember, when you store, start with Stay Bill.